What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Phyrexia All Will Be One draft. We are doing a premiere draft this time, which, you know, for those who don't know, this is a best of one over the course of seven rounds. Uh, potentially up to ten rounds, I guess. Because you could lose three. I guess I guess nine would be the maximum, because you'd, you'd win six, and then you'd lose three in a row, and then you'd, you'd, you'd be done. An oil counter on it. I don't care about that. that's just not. Rebel Salvo seems fantastic. This is a three-three flyer for five. That makes two one ones. I think we're gonna go with the Rebel Salvo here and hope we can get cool stuff. No. Uh, no. Oh, maybe. Enter's Battlefield does actually direct the number of permits you control with oil counters on them. That seems pretty good. Hex Gold Slash is also very good. I think we're taking this Fanatic of Mogus, though. Clearly, we're red. Where's Janna when you need him? Oh, yes. Basilica Shepherd? Nice. That seems good, right? Yeah, we're just going to take the Basilica Shepherd. We're going to be white-red in case it wasn't clear. Oh, uh, whenever you cast an Ocarina, just put an oil counter on this guy. Exile an artifact or creature, so blink it. Return an artifact or creature with mana value 3 or less. Choose one or both. It's up to you. Exile an online permanent. Three more to cast if it targets a creature. So it's six mana to hit a creature. Why is it so bad? I, mean, I think it's still probably good. It exiles a creature at instant speed. Meanwhile, this is a 4-3 with Vigilance for 5. That can re-equip. Maybe we just want the oil counter value? I don't know. Because I feel like this guy is slow at 3-3 three, three for 3. I'm on on board. Second artifact, Adam. Alright. I fell off the train. Medicine Reach is good. One damage to each creature your opponent's control, and they can't block. Sure. Two oil counters. 4-5 for five, 5. Creature gains haste. I'm going to take the Menace Reacher. Hunter's doing a big lay down behind me. Yeah, Planet Disruption is just great. Anyone else getting audio desync? I hope not. I'm looking at it in. I can when I, when I'm looking at myself, it doesn't look like I'm desynced. Red Sun's Twilight, easily the worst Twilight. Uh. I think we're just taking Thrill here. Try refreshing if that's the case. 7 5 for 8. It attacks each combat, can't be blocked by walls. Other creatures have base power and toughness 5 3 and are juggernauts. I wonder if that's any good. I mean, I'm gonna take it to find out. Oh yeah, flee from f flee from flesh, <laughs> flee from flesh. Uh, put in a, two all kinds of artifact creature control the card. Yeah, so these are very similar. Uh, this one draws you a card, and this one gives plus two plus two, and this one also costs two more. So we're just gonna take this. Combat tricks are decent and limited. This is a two three for three. That's not terrible. What do you do? Uh, yeah, that's actually pretty okay. Breaking Dawn is the worst Twilight. I mean, everyone's entitled to their own opinion as to which Twilight movie is the worst, or, or book, as it were. What is this thing? Phyrexian Wizard. 
Jesus Christ, it's got like heads dangling from it and everything. Oh yeah, this was actually, I, I actually wanted that guy, that was great. Oh, another Unctus, sweet. I've done two drafts and opened two Unctuses. Unctsi, if you will. Two, two for three. When it enters the battlefield and our creature gets plus, with Toxic gets plus one, plus one against flying. Uh, three, two with two oil counters in haste. Return it to its owner's hand unless you remove two oil counters from it. It's actually not bad. I mean, it's a great way to put oil counters on things. Yeah, we're going to take that guy. Hex Gold Slash is nice. Molten Rebuke. Five damage to a creature, Planeswalker, or destroying equipment. Ah, that's, that's also very good. Oh, Argenta Magmas Masticor. Protection from multi-color. Beginning your upkeep. Sacrifice it unless you discard a card. Destroy a non-land permanent and opponent controls with man value. I'm gonna, I think this guy's probably pretty good, right? God, I hope so, because I just took it. We also have a lot of five drops here. Another arena? Are people just not taking Phyrexian Arena? I don't understand. The problem with white-red, white is not the color that gives toxic tokens. Red isn't. I think I said white. I don't know. I think it's Molten Rebuke here. God, our 5-drop slot's looking fat. It's still good. Still the best card, you know? Ossification. Exile a creature and opponent controls until it leaves the battlefield. It will likely not leave the battlefield. Yeah, I just gotta take Ossification here. Another Molten Rebuke. So this is a 3-1. This is another 5 drop. Oh my god, these cards are so expensive, dude. I guess I just take the three one. Vindictive Flame Stoker. I think that guy's pretty good. Another Hex Gold Slash. Did I take the first one? I don't think so. I guess we're taking that. Recast the non creature spell, put a Oil Counter on it. Discard hand and draw four cards. I think this guy's probably pretty good. Oh, a Volt Charge. Well, that's a Volt Charge. This is so much removal. I don't understand why there's so much removal in this format. We only have three white cards. It's very possible we're not... They're all good. But it's very possible we don't have to be white. Remove three oil counters, draw a card. Interesting. I think we're just taking this guy for now. So what are the odds they're going to be corrupted? It feels low. But, whatever. It's not impossible, you know? Hex Gold Slash and Molten Rebuke. Are we the only red drafter? Equipment costs one less for a 2-3. Yeah. We still don't have a Hex Gold Slash, so I might as well get one. Sawblade Scamp is fine. Chimney Rabble? I was actually hoping for that little four drop. Serum Core Chimera is... Yeah, I mean, it was definitely... leaning me towards blue. Especially with, like... Like, this guy's pretty good. A 3-4 for 4 that, like, you could just return any of your, your good spells. Venerated Rot Priest. Don't care about you. Okay, so nothing great in the uncommons and rares. Nothing good for the white cards. <laughs> this pack's pretty bad. Um, it's not great. Not great. An update is available. What? I'm in the middle of a draft. Oh, that was terrifying. I thought it was going to literally close. 
I was like, but wait, no. I guess it's just a 1-3. I don't know. We don't have a ton of 2-drops, I don't think. Another Serum Core Chimera. We could have had 2. 2-4 two, four for 4. Actually, that's not terrible. So this is a 4-2 for 4. It might just be Serum Core Chimera. I'm going to take this. I think it's better than the other options. And who knows? 3-3. Three, three. At the beginning of each player, it deals 2 damage to that player unless they control 2 or more basic lands. Okay, so that's never going to trigger Unlimited. But it is very good in Constructed, I, I presume. There's a little Geth. Why don't you take a Geth? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I could see it doing. I'll take the I'll take the aspirant here. Sorry, oh my god! I just might play green. Maybe I'm just green. Oh wow, that's that's a bomb, dude. How do you even deal with this guy? Now I'm looking at the green cards. Molten Rebuke. See, like, there's no good white cards in here, so it's not white. The blue cards are kind of poop, so I guess I'll just take Plague Nurse. It's not great. Indoctrination Attendant. 3, 4, for 4. Oh, it makes a 1, 1. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. Is it worth just playing green for Theron? <laughs> I mean, Probably. We could just be mono red with the Thrun. We lose two good removal spells, but we have a ton of red removal. See, Apostle Invasion is really good, but again, it's really hard to get them corrupted when you're base red. I think despite the fact that traditionally white and red have been the mirror in colors. Um, they are not uh, well suited for each other in this format. I mean, this is still a 3-3 three, three Menace. Which I think is pretty good. Another Furnace Strider, huh? Hmm. If the enchant creature is toxic, it's hexproof. Otherwise, it gets plus two, plus two. Social library for a basic line of proliferate. Sure, I'll just put this in the signboard here. Hmm. All right, so this, this went very, very interestingly. I have no idea if it's any good, but I guess we'll find out. This is best of one, though, so... Okay, you can go, you can go. Raptor. This guy. Is it... I mean, Juggernaut just makes all your guys five threes, right? That feels pretty good. I got one Axiom Engineer. Uh, equipment spells. This guy doesn't seem great. He has a 2-3 with Menace. Do you consider from here an equipment or a creature? It's a creature. It's 100% a creature. It comes into play as a creature. Uh, probably, how many creatures is this? So I know how many I can... 18? Okay, that actually gives us... We can probably cut three even. Probably cut one adaptive of this dude. 
Blade Rough Aspirant, while having Menace, is just not fantastic. This is a 3-4 for 4, which I like with Toxic, so I mean, that's kind of fine. I do like Double Sawblade Scamp because it makes Graz really good. Like, it just turns them into 5-4s. <laughs> like, we can turn a bunch of our little 1-1s one into 5-4s. This is... What? Okie dokie. Um, so we need one cut, but I'm not sure if we even want to cut anything else. I think this might just be fine. I'm a, I'm a 41er. I 41 before. I'll 41 again. All right, so we got Flame Stoker into a bunch of expensive stuff. Sounds good. Cut a land using <laughs> Sissy. No, Sissy's not in this set. She was, uh, I, I don't know if there's any new Sissy cards. I think the last one was in like uh, Invasion Block. Oh no, there was a Sisse in Modern Horizons 1. It was Sisse Weatherlight Captain, so. You were close though, Rob. What does this little bird do? 1 3 for 2. When it attacks and punches three more poison counters, creatures you can. That's pretty good. Uh, no attacks. Come on, three drop. We have a ton of three drops. I'll even take a two drop. What do you got here? Mirror, the Mycosynth Gardens. Here comes a copy of a non-token artifact you control. Sounds good. That was not a land, that was not a three drop or or a two drop. I'm gonna say no attacks. Where's my oil at? This guy needs oil, this guy needs oil. This guy's fine. Oh boy. This is the one power crew. Oh boy, that guy is fat. I guess we're getting in there. If they want to block. The oh, this guy's got vigilance. Oh, biscuits. For some reason I didn't even notice that, you know? They don't. Oh, okay, cool. We'll just bounce. No harm done. This guy too, huh? Sure, I'll fall for your tricks. Fascinating. What? This is actually surprisingly close to, to triggering because they only have two basic lands. Oh boy. I'm sorry, what? Did they choose the wrong mode? 
stop it. Get some help. Wait, what? They cast this and nothing happened? I wish there was... Why isn't there a... There should be an event viewer where I can see what happened. Like, what just happened? They cast this. Nothing was sacrificed. I'm so confused. <laughs> I guess I did sacrifice all my tokens. However many there were. What does this guy do? Sure. Nothing? Menace. Menace. I have no oil counter. It's really sad. This guy's a blank right now. Okay, they're uh, presumably going to pump their whole team. Seems fine. Yeah, that seemed totally fine with me. This is nine damage. So, I was just saying, now they take nine. That's a lot. I guess they just die. Okay. I'll claim my prize. Yeah, I don't. I don't know what that was. That I don't. That that match was very strange. It did not feel. I I did not feel challenged. Let's say. Well, that's a snap keep. It's not my turn, right? <laughs> okay, just checking. I'm like, what are we waiting for here? What is the holdup? Oh, they went to six. Sure. Fascinating. Dang, our Furnace Punisher is already offline. Sad. Do you think they're trying to hit a land? Yes, they are. <laughs> Okie dokie. Sure. They did it on their turn, not on... Oh, I guess they, they had... 
pro perfect prism on our turn, so. Sure. Would love a creature here. You know, that we can cast. Sounds good. Mm, discard red here. Okie dokie. <laughs> oh boy. Well. Can we top deck up the run? That would be cool. Uh, sure. The answer was no. I'm just trying to lose if you gain two life, sure. Not the best use, but I don't want them to get too out of control. What does this do? So you just get to move an oil counter onto something? Sure. I really don't want a poison counter because I feel like they're going to try to proliferate onto us and being able to prevent that feels good. Oh, what up? Magic Maker Smarker Studio. I hope you're enjoying the gym, buddy. Yep, that's fine. Oh, now they're gonna mill us. Sack another artifact. That's intriguing. No, don't like that. I feel like we're going to lose because we just drew very, very poorly this game. Although they have one card in hand. We do have Graz the Unstoppable Juggernaut. They got a land and there was a Plains. Fascinating. So I assume their last card is a white card. Are they thinking of sacking the prophetic prism? Well, do they even need this, though? They have prism. <laughs> Makes me feel like I'm a lion at Genghis Grill. I don't even know what that means, but it sounds funny. Might as well hit him. Okay. What? I'm gonna take it. Sack prophetic prism. The sack the font? Why even play this? What in the earth? What? Okay, that's pretty good. I guess I'm discarding the jugs. No, 
Oh, it's gotta be this stupid card, right? Oh, that's good. Wow. The perfect hit. Lucky, 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 lucky. Sure. Like, Juggernaut just wins us the game if we hit, like, land, land. Right? Oof. I mean, that's, not, that's a nice, that's a nice little cantrip. Okay, you just had a land. I'm okay with it. Oh wow, they're just getting in there for seven. <laughs> this is an artifact, beautiful. So, I actually kind of want to keep this guy around because it's just... Because this guy wins us the game on our own if we just let him on, leave him on board. Is it a land? They didn't even use this. They didn't put oil counters on anything. If they had this, they could have put oil counters on and started milling us. I don't understand this four-color deck they're playing. Okie dokie. Well. Oh yeah, bronze tier three, baby. What's it gonna be? Something good? No. Nothing at all good. Four color poop stuff? What's the fixing? I guess there's that altar at Uncommon. This was a nice keep. No, it's just what happens when you're in a trap. Oh, okay. Got it. Okay, that guy's good. Honestly, I kind of just want to kill it. But like, it just feels like bad value. Yeah, I think we should have played this, pumped this, made, given a Vigilance. We could have looted at the end of the turn, discarded this, made sure we hit a land, and then Urbrax is anointer. But I don't really want to take a hit, is what it comes down to. So I'm going to pass here. trading? Are you gonna kill my guy too? No. 
and you did nothing. That's fascinating. This is just a 2-2. Two -two. Look at the top three cards. Sure. I'm excited. or what's the deal here? Sounds good. Uh, Glistener, sure. Okay, okay, okay. Just gonna play this guy. I mean, they have six cards, but we have a better board, so that's good. And that, that's your, like, that's almost your whole turn. Like, we get to deal seven? Probably six and a loot. Get a Thrun out? Where's our Thrun? Come on. What does this guy do? Is this just the plus two plus oh? Yeah, sure, that's fine. So I assume they block 2-2, two, two, they take 5. Or we can kill it and attack for 7. That feels better. Pitch this guy. Draw that guy. Oh, we should have played this guy first. Son of a bitch. That was terrible. That's probably smart. So 
there's passing? There's no way they're passing, right? They gotta play something and they did not play anything. Six mana. I actually don't know what they could have here. I mean, is there a settle the wreckage? I think the the black zenith. Yep, that's what I was. That's what I was figuring they had. But I thought it was black black X. Yep, that was my that was that was my concern. Did they not block, though? Like, it's clear they killed a token. Oh, it comes in tapped. Oh, that's pretty good, then. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. So they have three mana, and we have... Th Three lethal creatures almost. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Did you have fun in the match? <laughs> you know what? Sure. I'll give it to you. I feel like the best of one definitely takes longer. So best of one, you're minimum playing three games. Uh, oh yeah, we'll keep this. Sure. Three one drops and a throne and no, no forests. Ideal. Look at this aggro. Oh no, my whole my whole life is shut down now. Uh let's get rid of five drop. That's beautiful. Toxic? Oh, you don't have toxic, that's too bad. <laughs> So it's just a reach guy that proliferates. Sure, no attacks. Well, we're on... Flying Vigilance and a dodge draw card. That seems good. Alright, one more green. And we're Thrunning. Thrunning with the devil. Interesting. You don't have Toxic, do you? No? Okay. I'll allow it. <gasps> oh, that's the end. <laughs> Give me that sweet scoop. Okie dokie. So this goes to two next turn. We can go land, hex gold slash, put this to two, activate, draw four. Hmm. Can be the target of non green spells. Yeah. Do you got reach? Thrun does not have reach. It's too bad.
There's about a fifth of the oil counter. Gets plus one for each oil counter. Where you cast an iron creature spell, put an oil counter on it. Sure. <laughs> That'll do it. Okie dokie. Are we, uh, are we winning? Are we winning, Pop? Okay, so we have uh, almost broken even, basically. So even if we go 3 here, we're still in good in good shape. Three, three, Titanic. How long are you streaming this evening? Probably until after this draft. And then I gotta go get dinner ready. It's not my turn, right? Under left. This is going well. This is a good, this is a good fun round. Oh boy. Google Mr. Yuck sticker. I don't. I've seen this image, but I've never actually seen, I, I never knew what this was. That's so funny. Dude, ads on Twitch drive me insane. Like, I get ads on YouTube because, like, I've said this before, I get ads on YouTube because when the when the ad's over, the content is still there. It just continues where it, where it left off. But an ad on Twitch, you're actually missing content. Am I just going to win? I don't understand how long this takes for me to... When am I winning? Boy, oh boy. They don't control two basics, so this is actually going to deal them damage, I guess. <laughs> That's kind of funny. I mean, as far as being a streamer, I don't mind ads because that's one of the main ways that I get revenue, right? Like, I mean, I sit here and I stream for free, and sometimes people sub, sometimes they don't, so... 
Ads are a nice way to supplement that, and I have no problem with the existence of ads as a consumer or as a creator. Like, I also don't mind watching ads because I understand, like, hey, ad revenue is really helpful for content creators. So is our opponent playing his cards. What is this? What is this dragon? What is this thing? This lizard. Okay, they have to have, why, why are, I, I, this is it, right? Three, three turns in a row, that's gotta be the end, right? Okay, that was, that was a fun match. Anzi, buddy, congrats on the new job, buddy. As someone who was laid off in December, I know the feeling. All right, well, let's see if we can 2-0 this bad boy. Ziatora. That makes sense. Hey, first time we've seen this this bad boy. I mean, when you discard cards, this just makes every card a removal spell, right? Like I discard a four mana spell, I deal, I, I destroy a four drop. Zeator made it in the cube. Let me see what Zeator does. It's a six drop, right? Oh no, Zeator is the incinerator. I'm thinking of Zeatora's. I'm thinking of. No, it's not even that. Okay, it's a six six. Oh yeah, we're keeping. It's a six six flyer for six. The beginning of your end step, you may sack another creature. When you do, it, it deals damage equal to that creature's power to any target, and you create three treasures. That's actually decent. I like that it's on end step so that you actually do get to use it. Oh, Jesus. Where did that... Oh, my God. That was terrifying. I didn't know what was happening. Yeah, I love that those trigger before the spell resolves. So if you don't have any, you will get them and then you can proliferate. Hmm. How nice. The only I'll never forget the home we lost. Okie dokie. Okay, well. Drawing two mountains is not nothing. Viridin is our land. <sighs> Just lost two to the head two white suns twilight. That seems decent. That's does that does not seem as decent. Uh, so this guy costs five. Can't do that. Four. Okay, don't have a green. Don't have five. Don't have eight. That guy's big. I mean, I'm kind of tempted to just alpha here. We lose a three three, but then they lose Koth, so. 
I really don't want them to just have a Planeswalker on the board, especially when it goes to five next turn. Yeah. Oh, that doesn't do what I wanted to do. Son of a bitch. Oh, God, that's frustrating. I thought that was going to... Yep, should have just attacked. Oh, God. Yep, that's bad. Correct. That was a punt. We take this land from Pyrexia. Ugh, God. Yeah, for some reason I thought Sawblade Scamp was player or planeswalker. Yep, that guy's big. Must be nice having consistent access to lands every turn. I did know reading the card explains what the card does. Unfortunately, I thought I knew what the card did, so I didn't think reading was necessary. I mean, we're just going to have to alpha into Koth, or else Koth kills this guy eventually. So they can probably kill Vindictive Flamestoker and Sawblade Scamp here. Yeah, that's fine. Another loss. Oh, no. Well, we got 19 cards in hand. And more lands. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 12. We have 4, 5, 6, 7. They only have 5 more cards than us. That seems good. They've drawn 3 from both of these. Cool. Must be nice. Guess I'll take 11. Oh boy, we're having a good time. Oh yeah, that's gonna do it. Yeah. Unfortunately, the 7 -0 dream will not be it's not, it's not alive here. But. I believe we can do it. I don't think the pun was that big of a deal. They got one extra mountain out of it. Uh, this is definitely a keeper. Two banging five drops. Uh, Titanic Growth is a super easy pitch. Oh my god, what is this thing? Look how big these things are. I just got my little dog over here that doesn't encroach upon anything, and you got this big eagle that's like taking up half the screen. Oh, fascinating. Give me a four drop. I'm actually tempted to discard a land here. Trample whenever it attacks, gets plus extra extra number permits you control. Oh, so one. Got it. Oh, future draft bits. Urk, what up, buddy? Good seeing you, my dude. Submit one. Because I want a four drop or something to play next turn. Mm, that'll do. That will even, that will also do. Rebel, rebel. Sure. That was an interesting choice, because now I know you're not going to double block. Why wouldn't you just wait until post-combat, or, you know, at least until I announced attacking. 
Being of rep, you put an oil counter on another target non-token artifact or creature you control. Two, and a tap, create a 1-1. One, one. Activate only if an oil counter is removed from permanent you control. That's terrible. I'm pretty sure we thought this was terrible in our review. 3-3, three, three, got it. Uh, just take three. And then I'll play my beautiful, beautiful Thrun or my Argentum Masticor, either of which should win us the game. Oh, uh, yeah, that's fine. Which one comes first? 5-5 five, five or 5-5? Five, five? Probably 5-5. Five, five. No attacks. So now I'm going to be a little more conservative about playing things because I want to be able to have cards to discard to our Masticore. Masticore basically says you can't play cards for the rest of the game because you always want to have at least one thing to discard. But the reward you get is pretty good. Remember when we, we pivoted into green in pack three because we just got past the Thrun? That was pretty cool. Whenever another creature or artifact you control is from a graveyard from the battlefield, he gets an oil counter. Whenever it attacks, you may remove two oil counters to, to make a creature not block, sure. Ooh, no attacks, nice. So that doesn't... None of these guys are artifacts, so that's not really doing... That don't impress me much, you might say. Um, Thrun is indestructible? Sure, we'll get in there with a Thrun. It's your boy. <laughs> wonder if this guy gets countered. Yeah, I don't feel like they have a counter deck. Give that Forge Hammer Centurion a, an oil. Oil him up. Lube him up. Yeah, that's what we were concerned with. That's unfortunate. This feels like a pretty easy block. <laughs> um, pitch this. Okay, that's just a four two. So we have six power on board. Oh, I think we just win here, right? Loving you with the old Thrunner. Sometimes you get Thrunner, Thrunner, you know? Satisfying. Okay, I guess we just got one more... One more round to see if we're... Seven win champs. Victorious. And if you guys want to support the channel, be sure to subscribe or follow. Both of those greatly help things. Um, yeah, this seems fine.
again, we got your boy. So, you know. <laughs> we might have given them a ticket to the route train. It's a good question. Uh, decline. I will just play you as a tutu. Play him as a man. Send him on down to rat train. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the rat train? <laughs> good times. Get in there. Give him the nugs. You're pretty good at this game. Maybe good enough to top eight pro. I don't think so. Let's not go crazy. I don't even think pro tours exist anymore, so I don't even know what you're talking about. Sure. Certainly. Fascinating. So we can go land, and then we can go. We can kill both of these guys, which is kind of cool. And then just attack for four. Or I could just kill this guy and play a guy and then attack for two. That seems better. What is this? Plus two, plus two and flying or something? Yeah. Sure. Sounds good. We got a pro tour next week. I don't think it's called pro tour though, is it? Oof. Fascinating. I mean, I kind of just want to volt charge that. The new combat, the next time a creature would deal, the next time target creature would deal combat damage to one or more players this turn. Prevent that damage. Next time target creature. Okay. So they have to target something. We get to know what it is before. So they can actually... They can give it five, prevent five. Yeah, we're just gonna have to attack here. So this is five, they go to nine. Their mites can't block though. So if they wanna like crack that, put five mites into play, we're probably doing okay. That might be good for us. Okay. Oh, it's your boy. I mean, Volt Charge also goes face, so they're kind of at six. Oh, so close. That's fine. Yeah, we're just gonna play Throne here. I think I think the combination of all these creatures on board is gonna be enough with the Volt Charge. You're so you're so you're so throny and you don't even know it. Choose that Skeeto. Oh, interesting. You got reach? Still no? Okay. Just checking. They can't block, though. What? Now they're dead. 
What? I'm so confused. That was cute and all, but... So, I guess we're just gonna put this on here. Because he has trample, so if they want if they want a double block, then they die to the other guys. If they want a single block, they're taking at least two, and then these guys kill them. And you have one card in hand. Okay. Okay, so you're taking five. So you're dead? Draw a card. Sounds good. Okay. That'll do it. 7-1. Seems good. Apparently we're experts at this format. In the bronze in the bronze league. Gotta do what you got. You gotta start somewhere, you know? What is this? A beautiful sinewy ball. 2,206 packs. Let's open our packs. I think we have nine. Oh, 11. It's even better. What do we got here? Trash. Trash. Good. I like this guy. Good. Sweet. Trash. Actually, maybe that's fine. Good. Okay. And they got one more. Eh. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Be sure to let me know what I did wrong because I'm sure you'll like to do that. And uh, I'll catch you next time. See you later, guys.